Good morning, it's January 8th, Wednesday, first video vlog of the new year. I wanted to reach out to everybody and say Happy New Year and let you know we got about three inches of snow last night in Coeur d'Alene. Of course, it's been much colder in parts of the country. Uh, the North Midwest has been freezing below zero temperatures. We're hanging out about 25 to 35 lately. Anyway, nice weather. We got our Christmas snow about two weeks late. Um, wanted to give you a market update based on the Coeur d'Alene market as it relates to some of the national news about real estate that you've heard lately. I uh, was reading an article yesterday regarding uh, how different markets uh, geographically have performed coming out of the recession. And the important thing to remember, and the, in the consultation I had with my seller last night, that every market, including every micro market within our county, uh, is uniquely different in the value appreciation of homes. Um, for example, we've got a place called Dalton Gardens that is probably appreciated on move-in ready homes about eight, nine percent. Other places, other neighborhoods um, have been maybe five percent, some are flat. It depends on the inventory in that particular type of home or neighborhood. And you've heard these statistics of year over year 12% increase in home values and remember those numbers are skewed by the very highs which would be something like Phoenix or Vegas parts of California Riverside which were very depressed um, that have come back up to 25 30% above their historic lows and those lows were very low um, and then they contrast those with somebody uh, a market center like Alabama um, you know, metropolises of uh, parts of the country that have only ticked up about two or three percent. Um, so it's important to know in your particular market, um, wherever you're planning on buying or selling, that you know the inventory and you know what the activity has been and you can uh, establish what your increase might be. And of course the best way to do that is to get a quick CMA from a professional real estate agent. Anyway, I went to a listing appointment last night in a nice neighborhood up on the hill, a place called Woodland Heights, and there was um, a seller, single man, who has a home he's owned for 10 years, and his home in that 10-year period, remember that would be buying in 2003, so in that period he's probably appreciated about 32%. So bought it for two hundred thousand. It's now worth um, it's worth solidly three twenty five. So that's a pretty good increase. Um, got a good price on it, and is now in a good position. The neighborhood he's in was sluggish in 2010, 11, part of twelve, and now it's really starting to tick up. And most of that is due to inventory in that price range, three to four hundred thousand. Anyway, I hope that helps. Again, if you're interested in your home's current value, it's important to talk to a real estate agent or a professional in the market to know exactly what it is in your neighborhood that has moved. Thanks, John out.